Hi guys, I hope you're all doing well on this terrific Tuesday. My name is Brooke. I live just north of Houston, Texas. And um, I just wanted to do a quick testimonial and share something with you guys, um, my fellow FMD family, um, because I learned something new that I just wanted to share with you all. Um, just to give you a little backstory on me, um, I have FMD in both of my vertebral arteries, both my carotid arteries, and both my renal kidney arteries. So go big or go home is my motto. <laughs> um, thankfully, uh, well, I say thankfully, I've only had a dissection in one body part. Um, my left vertebral artery dissected um, five years ago on Christmas Day of all days. Um, I have been pretty uh, well overall since then, other than the chronic fatigue that I think a lot of us deal with. Um, but I just wanted to share something that I learned recently um, because I know several of us have mentioned in conversations and posts um, on our FMD group that many of us have been denied for life insurance. Um, and so I was recently approved, so I wanted to just kind of take a moment to share the information with you guys. Um, the company is called Globe Life Family Heritage Division. Um, they sell whole life insurance, cancer insurance, um, hospital indemnity, which is like long-term ICU stay, um, accidental injuries and death. They have several different policies that you can choose from. Um, and I was pleasantly surprised um, that I got approved for the heart insurance policy um, as well as all of the above, actually, I was approved for. Um, the life insurance is whole life insurance. Um, it may vary by patient. Um, you know, I had the left vertebral artery dissection with no stroke. Um, so that, you know, may have enabled me to get approved over somebody else. I'm not quite sure, you know, how it all exactly works. Um, my son is actually working for the company. He's the one that sold me the policies. Um, and so I, I thought, hey, I'll, I'll share this information with you guys and see if anyone is interested in it. Um, because like I said, it's, it's really a good deal. Um, not only will they, or did they approve me for life insurance, but all of these other supplemental policies that genuinely pay out when you go have all the testing and the scans that uh, many of us need um, every six months or annually. You know, none of them are cheap. I'm always still paying off thousands and thousands of dollars in debt, um, you know, from scans. And we don't just need a regular CT scan or MRI. A lot of the times we may need MRAs or I have to get intracranial Dopplers every year. And all of that stuff is super expensive. Um, so it definitely adds up. And the way that these policies work, they're a supplemental policy um, in addition to your medical insurance. So, you know, we all know our medical insurance covers a certain, certain portion and there's generally always a lot left over in my experience. Um, and these actually help supplement that. Um, and I don't know all the details. You're welcome to reach out to Austin. I'll, I'll put his information um, in the comments of this post. Um, and no pressure, but again, it wouldn't hurt to reach out to him. And there's no harm in applying and see if you qualify, because if you do, it's phenomenal. Um, and the great th one of the other great things about this particular company is with the, their policies, if you end up not using it, they'll give you a full refund. But we all know in reality, most people in our case with FMD will most likely use it because it will, I mean, it can pay out up to $200 per scan. Uh, I mean, that's cash in your pocket. Um, anyhow, I, I won't make this lengthy. I just wanted to kind of let you guys know I am a real person. I'm sharing my story. Yes, my son does work for the company, but I thought it would be awesome to share this with my FMD family, brothers and sisters, because it's so discouraging for some of us who have been denied before. And uh, the fact that I finally found a company that's willing to accept us is awesome. So please feel free to reach out to Austin if you have any questions. Take care. Bye-bye.